Hello everyone. So in this video, we will learn about what is the journal entry for check dishonor. So when a check is dishonored, what types of entry we will make in Bookshelf account? So we will learn in this video. When a business receives a check, it debits its bank account and credits this party from which check is received. So a business receives a check from some party. So we debit our bank account and credit the party from whom we are receiving the check. So such entry should be made in books of account. So let's understand it with an example here. Here a sales made to Mr. Mohan by check rupees 10,000. We make sales to Mohan here and the payment to receive from is by check. So in this case we will open two accounts bank account and sales account. And we debit sales account, sorry, debit bank account and credit sales account. And why we do so? Because bank is a personal account and as per personal account, debit the receiver and credit the giver. And here, bank is the receiver, so we will debit that. On the other hand, sales is a nominal account and as per law of uh, like a golden rule of uh, sales uh, nominal account, we credit all income and gains. So sales is an income here. So we credit that. So in this way our banking entry of receiving is made. Next, the check which we receive from Mohan is dishonored and the bank has charged rupees 550 as bank charges. Now whatever check is received from Mohan in this entry, like in the earlier entry, like we will receive this check bank to sales. Now this check is dishonored. So in this case, we will credit our bank account because we are adjusting our bank now which is debited earlier we will credit it and we are like uh, making it zero now like whatever we have debited so we credit it so we will removing that account from from the debit side similarly we open a new account mohan account because now we have to take this money from mohan so mohan is a personal account so he will be the giver us in future so that's why we debited 10000 and we will write being checked is ordered Next, the bank charge of dishonor check need to be taken from Mohan. Now, there is another charge also like 550 charge, like here it is written. So, that to be taken from Mohan. But now, when we will uh, take the passbook, first of all, we will uh, put down like this bank charges or like the uh, dishonor check charges, sometimes such, something like that account should be open. And that is a nominal account, so we debit it to bank and that will be credited from our bank also so we will make this entry bank charges account debit to bank so we credit our bank account here now this uh, bank charges should be taken from mohan because it's because of him like we have to pay this 550 because the dishonor of check is there so at the end mohan is liable to pay rupees 10,550 so 10,000 we have already written in his account now we have to write this 550 also so for that what we will do, we will make an entry of Mohan debit 550 to bank charges. So we will credit our bank charge account here and we will just adjust that bank charge account and open a new uh, and add it to Mohan debit account. So now we, uh, when we create the ledger of Mohan, so in the ledger of Mohan there will be a debit site where we will return 10,000 to should be taken, this 5 to which is should be taken. So in the in the balance side we will have to take ten thousand five fifty from Mohan. So we are a Vista Academy. So if you are interested in our course, the new skills in accounting, you can join our classes. Thank you very much.